Question from Archer Q Bank. Which of the following signs and symptoms would be expected in a client with Cushing's disease? Select all that apply. A. Hypotension. B. Acne. C. Hirsutism. D. Buffalo hump. Answer. Choices B, C and D are correct. Explanation. B is correct. Acne is an expected symptom of Cushing's disease. This is due to increased sex hormones, such as testosterone, estrogen, and progesterone. Excessive levels of these hormones cause oily skin to build up, which often leads to acne. C is correct. Hirsutism is defined as an excessive body in either men or women in places where the hair usually is absent, such as the chin or cheeks of the face. Hirsutism is caused by an increased amount of androgens or male sex hormones, such as testosterone, in the body. In Cushing's disease, there are increased levels of sex hormones, therefore hirsutism is often seen in these clients. D is correct. A buffalo hump is the classic sign of Cushing's disease. This refers to a lump of fat that develops between the shoulder blades on the top of the back. It is due to the excessive amount of glucocorticoids that clients with Cushing's disease have. Glucocorticoids cause the breakdown of fats and when there are too many, they can cause fat redistribution. This often leads to fat in odd places, such as a buffalo hump. Other signs of Cushing's disease due to fat, redistribution are truncal obesity, moon face, and liplessness. Choice is incorrect. Hyper, not hypotension would be expected in a client with Cushing's. This is due to too many mineralocortics, specifically aldosterone. With increased levels of aldosterone, the body retains too much sodium and water. With increased fluid in the vasculature, the blood pressure rises, and the patient is hypertensive. Hypotension would be expected in a patient with Addison's disease, where the body has a decreased amount of steroids. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for daily NCLEX question.